Welcome to our channel. Now, if you're a tea enthusiast, you're in for a treat. Today's video might seem a bit unconventional for tea lovers like you, but trust me, it's worth your while. We're diving into something unique and rarely discussed on our YouTube channel. Our specialized tea consulting service tailored for tea producers, owners, and farmers who are ready to step into the world of specialty teas or enhance their current offerings. If you decide to stick around, I truly appreciate it. But if you're looking for something more customer friendly, I totally get it. And hey, if you're a farmer or producer who has been referred to this video, a big thank you for joining us. Throughout this video, we will walk you through what we bring to the table, who we are, and why choosing us is a game changer for your tea offering. Anshuman, a black tea expert and tea estate owner from Darjeeling, India, learned invaluable insights after just a few days of interaction with Jian Li, our tea consultant. Even after months of a prior tea making immersion in China, he says that he found our expertise transformative. If you are navigating the leap from orthodox or CDC tea to the world of specialty tea, or you are already crafting specialty teas and want to refine quality or expand your range, our comprehensive services hold the key to unparalleled success. As Chinese tea experts and seasoned consultants, we stand ready to tackle your challenges head on. We are a dynamic trio. Our team comprises of three experts, Jian Li stationed in China, and Phil and myself based in Canada. You may have already perused our website, but allow me to spotlight what's most relevant to you as a tea producer. Jian Li's extensive experience of almost 30 years includes decades of immersive travel across China's tea regions. For the last decade, she has been closely collaborating with the tea producers, guiding them in developing new tea varieties and enhancing their existing offerings. This comprehensive approach encompasses all six tea types. Recent years have seen her commitment deepen, spending up to 10 months annually in various tea regions driven by her passion for perfecting the craft. Jenny's incredible amount of experience in the field, combined with her solid academic understanding of tea, makes us so powerful in action, and simply nobody can compare. Jenny has been traveling all over China's tea regions, working with the Chinese tea producers, developing new teas, or improving the quality of their existing product lineup. The tea trip videos on our YouTube channel showcase a few places that Jian Li has visited. She is an expert in all six tea types. If you take a tea producer from Wu they will be expert in oolong and likely black tea making, but they won't know how to make green tea. If you have a tea producer from Yunnan, they're expert in making shen puar and possibly shu puar or black tea but not likely oolong tea. Same with the green tea. A Longjing green tea producer might know how to make black tea as well as green tea, but not white tea or other types of tea. Even within green tea, Longjing and Mengding Ganlu have very different process. Why are they processed differently? Simply speaking, because the environment and the cultivar are different. And over the many years these teas were produced, the methods gradually transformed into different ways of making green tea, bringing out the best from that cultivar and that origin. The Chinese tea cultivar plants you introduced to your land are inevitably different from when they are growing in their home region. What if the green tea process you are imagining doesn't work so well with them? Now what? 
Do you have time to wait hundreds of years as a trial and error gradually converges you on the right methods of making the tea as it did for the classic teas? Of course not. You need someone who has extensive experience working with various tea cultivars in various towers and various conditions. You need someone who expertly understands the dynamics between the leaf and process and is well seasoned to tailor the process for your plantation and farm. And that someone is Jian Li Wu. Give a man a fish or teach a man to fish. Our goal is to not only show you how to make specialty tea, but to teach you the reasons why it works. Why does the aeration thickness of the leaves have to be one inch, not four inches? Why can the leaves only be rolled for 15 minutes? Why is the resting time three hours, not three hours and 15 minutes? How do these changes affect the result? Only when you fully understand the essence and the nuance of the tea processing can you be confident handling different situations. We want to make sure that after we finish the project, you can adjust the machines, tweak the steps, and keep developing into a new future. Especially as we're facing global climate change, drought years, wet years, constantly challenging the consistent quality of your tea. And as a tea producer, you know how important consistency is. A rigid, formulated recipe of tea making steps is just not going to deliver. Remember I mentioned that Jianli travels a lot, often 10 months and a year. China's peak tea season is usually concentrated in a few months. So why is she still traveling in the slow season to make tea? Because these tools we're teaching the tea producers are so powerful. They want to see her whenever she is available. The tea farmers we have worked with have told us they learned so much about processing tea that they didn't even know they needed to learn. And the knowledge is so valuable and well explained that they still get incredible benefits for the upcoming tea seasons. There's a good reason that Jenny is a highly respected and called teacher by many tea producers in China. The way of appraising tea is very different between orthodox, CTC, and specialty tea. An Indian tea estate owner who specialized in orthodox tea and CTC tea wanted to produce specialty green tea. As a matter of fact, he bought Chinese green tea machines and tried them. Besides the machines not being installed quite right, he also didn't understand the taste produced by his experimental results because he's a long time black tea drinker and very new to green tea. In the end, the machines just sat in the corner of the factory collecting dust. We will show you how to appraise specialty tea and most importantly, help you link what you taste to what happened in the process room. Why is my green tea aroma so dull? Is it because of long aeration or is the kill green temperature wrong? Why does my oolong tea taste like a green tea crush into a black tea? What went wrong? How do I fix it? The answers to these questions can actually be found through tea appraisal. With a careful tasting and deduction, you can pinpoint exactly what went wrong. Thanks to Jenny's extensive experience with the processing, we've curated a considerable collection of tea samples for educational purposes. These are wackadoo experimental teas that we have collected along the way, and they're perfect for illustrating the dynamics between the nuanced tea processes and resulting taste. Our tea appraisal skills, along with this tea sampling pool, combined with our deep knowledge, are so illuminating that you just can't find this kind of training anywhere else. Why do you need to learn this? We want to teach you to fish, not give you a fish. 
This is a vital tool for your future endeavors. We've taught tea producers all over China how to appraise tea professionally so that they can take what they learned during the project and move forward. We receive an enormous amount of samples from tea producers we've worked with with comments like after left, we dial down the weathering but slightly increase the rolling time and we got sample number one. The aroma improved but the flavor become thinner and the results leaves still had a high breakage rate so I further tweak the resting time. They share their development with us and we share with them our feedback. They ask us, is the direction right? Are there any further ways to overcome the issues, etc. This is a skill that has benefited many tea producers in China and we believe it will also guide your future product development, making every step, every change more purposeful. Most Chinese tea producers don't speak English or speak very limited English. Sure, it's easy to find a translator who speaks English and Chinese. However, most translators don't speak the language of tea. This is where I come in handy. As a native Chinese, I speak the language of tea in Chinese. And after nine years in the North America tea industry, I'm also speaking the language of tea in English. Moreover, I'm well aware of the various pitfalls in the English tea world caused by translation mistakes and misunderstandings. Many times I have seen Chinese meaning get totally lost in translation because it's not translated by someone who understands tea. When it's just a casual tea talk, it's not a big deal. But when talking about tea producing skills and techniques, these become expensive mistakes. If your questions were not accurately delivered or the answers were not accurately conveyed back to you, your learning is greatly diminished. You might feel like you learned something, but when the project is over and it's time to proceed on your own, you will start to wonder again. As I've been emphasizing over and over, we want to give you a turbo boost and then for you to continue to rocket forward afterwards to be able to develop and improve your tea on your own. In order to achieve this, fully understanding the specialty tea process and mastering the nuances of the process and its impact is crucial. And this can only be achieved through accurate communication. Teaching tea producers how to use different machines to make better teas has always been part of our work, but it has been steadily expanding. In Jenny's recent visit to India, she noticed that some producers had bought Chinese tea machines but didn't know how to install them, or sometimes they put the machines together successfully but didn't know how to calibrate the machines. In the end, the salesmen of tea machines are not the ones that make tea. So Jenny helped them set up and adjust the machines as well as instructing them how to make tea with them. So if you're brand new to specialty tea making and getting started with various Chinese tea machines, we can get you set up quickly. Because someone is good at doing something doesn't mean they're also good at teaching others. Well, Jenny has been working with and teaching tea producers for years. Besides experience, we have also developed a system to best deliver the messages to tea producers from different backgrounds, allowing her vast academic field and tasting experience to make sense to your ears. So here's how we all fit together with you. We've got Jian Li, our chief consultant and the mastermind steering the ship. I'm your co-developer and interpreter, ensuring every step is seamless and communication is on point. Finally, Phil plays a vital role as our diligent assistant, meticulously recording each step for future reference. 
and when the journey concludes upon your request, we provide a comprehensive report and summary of the entire project. To get started, simply shoot me an email at gen at genti.ca and I'll be your point of contact. To delve deeper into your requirements, I recommend a video conference, a platform that enables us to efficiently pinpoint your needs and explore how we can provide valuable assistance. Following this, we will engage in a comprehensive discussion encompassing crucial details such as quotes and schedules. It's important to highlight that our approach is entirely customized to your needs and meticulously tailored for each project, regardless of your current standing within the specialty T domain. Your success is our goal. Well, that's a wrap for today. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're genuinely excited about the prospect of working with you and unleashing the full potential of your T-Craft. I'm looking forward to hearing from you soon.